And hello, everybody. We have returned. It is time to begin the next set of missions. Not Y-Wing. Fuck Y-Wings. Alright, we'll do A-Wing first. Yeah! Okay. Alright. So, uh... I don't like flying enemies as much as X-Wings. I love A-Wings. They're the coolest ship. Red Leader will pop up near an Imperial Actually, they're just the most practical. Actually, the B-Wings are the most practical. I hate the B-Wings. How dare you? Destroy the repair great. dock to disrupt Imperial operations. So, this is our first training mission into the A-Wings. Hey, is that a frigate? No, that Star is a Fighters, freighter. Transports and oh. shuttles are staged and waiting for repairs. <coughs> so we're going to attack a repair dock. Okay. Eliminate the targets and as apparently as we should be able to do it by ourselves as an A-Wing. That should be easy enough. Repaired ships may be circling the area, but are unarmed. We're fighting unarmed ships. Yeah. Red leader will pop up near okay. an... Since it was designed for long-range armed reconnaissance, one of the first operational test missions for the new A-Wing fighter was a sneak attack on a surprise target, an Imperial repair dock. Believing the Rebellion would not waste time on such an out-of-the-way target, the Empire had left the depot in completely unprotected. To the contrary, the Alliance was willing to hit the Imperial fleet anywhere it could. I... I have problems with that. A single ship was sent in to destroy as many craft as possible and hyperspace out when finished or endangered. Red Leader successfully destroyed the dock and 22 Imperial craft before narrowly escaping the fire of an Imperial frigate. Use your sensors and targeting system to locate your targets and plan your attack. Concentrate on the repair dock first. Though designed for dogfighting, your concussion missiles offer the quickest means to accomplish this. Adjust your power levels to keep your lasers fully charged. <laughs> Remember, the boosted laser blasts are more destructive and will destroy the targets more quickly. Eliminate all transports, shuttles, and Imperial Starfighters as quickly as you can before the Imperial Frigate, frigate! can reach you. Yes! Frigate! Also, we have uh, the full set of X-Wing badges now. Congratulations. And we have this little flight officer rank up here. Red leader all through theoretical Imperial. Well, technically, uh, flight officer is the base rank. I see. Look at the alien up here. Don't. It's a comp. It's happening. All right. So. Uh, it with my foot gently. As an A-wing, there are some things you must learn. You must learn never to look at big ships. Why not? Because they are not part of your job. Your job is to take out fighters. Except on this mission, where your job is specifically to take out the big ship. Actually. Destroy everything. <laughs> oh no! It's coming right for us. They're gonna win this game of chicken. <laughs> also, my shields regenerate way slower than the X wing. <coughs> well, good news that you uh, are fighting unarmed opponents, and they're not even moving. Just put everything in the lasers, dude. I need my shields, man. For what? For survival. <clears throat> what are you gonna do? Suicide bomb into them? Also, I have missiles instead of torpedoes. Which are only good against fighters. Ah. There's that weird thing where I can't aim at something. Is it called being terrible? No. This game has an issue. Some enemies give off like some kind of weird effect where you can't look straight at them. It makes you kind of swerve out of looking at them. It's weird. That's weird. I have no idea. Are you supercharging the lasers? They are already charged. Matching speed with target. Stops. Yep. These bombers are just parked. <coughs> yeah, that was probably easier than doing flybys. These TIE fighters look parked as well. <laughs> Your control dash says boob. What boob? Where? What? Boob. Oh, my missiles? Yeah. Your missiles are boobs. How old are you? Ten. <laughs> hey, look at these TIE fighters are flying around. Oh, God! <laughs> We're gonna get destroyed. Or beep. Oh. That's how a missile works. I think you took out two of them. Nope. Yeah, one. But you hurt him. <coughs> and you finished him. That's all the fighters in the area. Alright, cool. Everything's shuttles and transports now. Okay, go to destroy the freighter. Take out the shuttles, they have power. Oh. Well, the transports are deactivated. 
there's two frames, and they seem to be locked up together. It's Katie Kaboom. Katie Kaboom. Oh, wow, they don't have shields either. I was cutting it close there. Kind of work, yeah. So. Strategically speaking, there's a number of things wrong with this scenario. An, un an undefended repair dock? First of all, repair docks are incredibly important and they would never leave them undefended. This is before the rebellion was a uh, major factor to the Empire. Still, like, you would expect at least, like, a basic guard system of something. Like, there even if it was just, like, one ship. There are two TIE fighters that were flying around. I guess. Uh, it's better than nothing, I guess. And it's just these two freighters. They're locked together and called a repair dock. Because someone was too lazy to design a space station. And second of all... I'm just going to use my missiles. Like, this is a prime target for attacking the enemy. Like... Even if you have no enemies at the time, the first thing you would go for would be something on the outskirts that, you know, assists your entire fleet in some manner, such as a repair dock. Third, why would the Alliance go for this? This is a test for of the new alien. Sure. This actually makes sense for the Rebel point of view, but for the Empire, it doesn't make any sense at all. But, like, imagine North Korea making the decision, I'm using North Korea as a stand-in, to test out their new stealth bomber by <coughs> going after our s Antarctica outposts for research. There are better targets. There I mean, are ways this isn't to a bomber, though. This is an interceptor. Okay. I think my point still stands. I know, I know. I'm just saying. Anyway... I think I blew up everything. I'm waiting for my complete mission complete thing. There it is. Let's get out of here. Okay, right, as an A-Wing, I don't have a R2 unit, so I don't get the little noise when I get objectives complete. Aww. And yeah, that was our first A-Wing training mission. I do like A-Wings. Hey look, is that a frigate? That is indeed a frigate. Yes. I can't wait until we're done training so I won't be on a frigate anymore. <laughs> frigate. Alright, so yeah, that was it. Alright, I'll see you later, everybody.